Hi, I'm Becky Belote from Newport News, and I want to show you a new skill that you can use with your Creative Memories border punches. Um, it works with the ones where the where the border does not fall off the paper. So, like uh, the Dazzle, the Tulip, the Roller Coaster works with this nicely. The new Baroque one is great. Um, the Petal Frame, all good. You want to stay away from ones like the Basket Weave, where the border actually falls off. Okay, so um, what I want to show you how to do is, is, you know, a border tool makes borders, all right? So that's what they do. But I wanted you to think out of the box and not make a border, okay? Do something else. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold this paper on a diagonal, and then I'm going to cut it in half, all right? And I'm not going to bother with making sure that it's perfectly straight because it doesn't matter all that much because what we're getting ready to do. But the fold is going to make me cut it straight enough quickly. All right, so now I've got two triangles. And I'm going to do this to both triangles. I'm only going to do one now to just show you. All right, so and I'm going to use the dazzle for this demonstration. So I'm going to lower this so that you can see what I'm doing. Um, just put your triangle right in and mash. And then what I'm going to do is I'm gonna line up, hopefully you can see this, I'm gonna line up, just like when you usually make a border with this tool, um, line up the blue pattern underneath and go all the way across. It doesn't matter which way you go. Um, I could have gone that way. I've gotta do both ways anyway, um, but I am just went this way first so that you could see what I was doing. All right, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it back in and then do it the other way. So I'm lining up, there's a pattern that I'm lining up with. It's located on both sides so that it doesn't matter which way I go. All right, and so then I have a beautiful triangle instead of just a border, all right? And I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do that in a minute. And it works with any size triangle. Like for this one, I cut a six by six square, cut it at a diagonal, and I'll show you how fast this works. So I just put it in anywhere, it doesn't matter. Go ahead and line up your um, your pattern on both sides. So now I'm going to do it on this side too. And there you go. You go. All right. Um, these look really good layered. So if you do one and do another one, look how cool that looks. So let me show you um, some ideas that I made with this. So you can see how pretty it is. What I used was the Easter theme pack. It's the new one. It's so pretty. And um, so this one I did showing the triangles. If you like a double page spread, if you want to steal this idea, uh, this is what I did. Look close. I used the theme packs. They come with a cardstock. They come with four pieces of decorative paper. They come with embellishment. I mean, um, stickers that match. So it's everything that you need, and I made both of these spreads with that. So this is the big tri the big triangle, just to give you a different look. All right, so I hope you enjoyed that, and I hope you'll go try it. Thanks for watching. Bye.